Hey everyone, Mr. Demise here. This is a lap guide for Daily Race 8, which is at Tsukuba with the Renault Clio RS Trophy. And before we get started with the lap guide, I do want to note that this is for the 2016 Renault Clio RS. And for this Daily Race, BOP is on and tuning is off, which means that you don't have to tune the car. You don't need to do some silly things to meet the horsepower or PP requirement. All you need is the Renault Clio RS200 Trophy, the 2016 model that is. Make sure it doesn't have wide body, put some comfort soft tires on it, and that's it. You can do the time trial or even enter the race. And I also have the replays up on my Gran Turismo 7 profile, so if you want to check those out on your PS4 or PS5 console, uh, I'll have the links to those in the description down below. Uh, you can press the collection or the like button, so you can access them whenever you get on your console. But let's go ahead and get started with this lap guide. Uh, traction control is at zero. The only assist I have on is ABS, which is at default. So bring yourself towards the left side of the track and you're going to brake just after you pass the path that is on the left. In a moment, I'll show you exactly where I start to brake right here. Go at full braking power and you want to gradually make your way down to second gear. Ease off of the brakes as you're turning in, so doing some trail braking. But then go back up to third gear. This is to try to delay the turbo from kicking in when you start to get on the throttle so you can still keep turning in while you're accelerating and then the turbo will kick in. So hopefully by the time the turbo kicks in, you're already done with the turn. And then you want to brake as you reach the apex of this mini right turn. So this is exactly where I start to brake. We're going to do a very similar thing that we did in turn one where you go down to second gear as you turn in and then go back up to third gear to delay the turbo and get on the throttle. And then you're going to use a little under 50% braking power before the barrier on the left changes color and turn in as you brake. As you hit the apex, slowly get on the throttle to try not to end up understeering off the track. Then bring yourself towards the left, brake before the 50 meter board, and you're going to do the same thing that we did in the other hairpins where you brake hard for a while, go down to second gear, then back up to third gear to delay the turbo, then get on the throttle, and that should delay the turbo just long enough to be able to complete the turn. For the final turn, you're going to stay on fourth gear. So as the new sector starts, or before you pass the 50 meter board, this is where you want to brake hard for a short moment, start to ease off of the brakes as you're turning in, so doing some trail braking, then do lots of throttle control to try to bring yourself in towards a late apex, which is where the curb on the right ends. So this is where you want to start to fully accelerate your way out. But that is pretty much it for this lap guide. Hopefully this lap guide helps you out. And I'm going to go ahead and sign off now. So thank you guys for the support. Thank you to PlayStation for supporting the channel as well. Uh, this is Mr. MCA wishing you a good race and I'll see you in the next video.